Shading cells allows us to define one cell from another, such as in a table. So let's say that I'd like to shade these three different cells. So what I can do is under the Home tab, go over to the Fill Color, hit the drop down, and then choose the shade that I'd like. I want to be able to see the words underneath it, so I'll just choose a light one here. And we'll click on there, and there's our shade. So now I can go ahead and type in other things, and you can still see it. And then if I want to type underneath it, then you know that this is a header category. Another option, if we undo that, is to use the styles here at the top. And what I can do is, once again, I can select my three different cells, and I can hit the drop down, and I can choose from several different options. I can choose the good, bad, and neutral model. I can choose the data model that we see here for calculation, output, things like that. I can also choose basic themes. So I'm going to choose this accent theme that we see here. And now it's automatically shaded all the different cells that I put in. It also comes up, because it is a style, it'll come up with a color that uh, accents that, that uh, shading as well. So if I type in name here, then we can see it very clearly as to what it is. And if I'd like to change that, I can do that. I'll just hit the drop down, and we'll choose a, let's say, calculation one. So not only do we see the shading, but we also see that the color makes it so you can still see it very well. So that's how you shade cells in Microsoft Excel.